Hi guys, welcome to my channel. This video is a travel vlog and review of this resort. This is a late upload from my trip to Mexico back in November and we stayed at Blue Bay Grand Esmeralda in Rivera Maya. In the lobby and throughout the resort they had started setting up for Christmas. I traveled with my sister-in-law and two nieces. We stayed for five days. We had an early flight so we had to wait for our room. Um, but after lunch the room was ready so it wasn't much of a wait. In our building, unfortunately, the elevator was out of service. It was really nice of the staff to take our luggage up to the third floor because um, our luggage is pretty heavy. The room is it's a standard room. We have the garden view. It was a basic room, quite dated, but it was large and clean. The bathroom was good size. We had double sink. There was enough space to keep all our things. The shower was large, the water pressure was good, and the water was soft, made my skin feel really nice. Um, just had to make sure not to drink the water, not to get any water in my mouth since it's not good to drink the water in Mexico. The room had these large closets. It was great to be able to store all our things. So with four girls in a room, we had a lot of stuff, a lot of shoes, a lot of clothes. So we were able to store our things, keep it out of the way. The room had just the regular things you would expect, iron board. Um, there was a safe to keep our valuables, ice bucket and a mini fridge and um, they did a really good job of restocking the fridge every day with beer, water and soft drinks and pop. Our room had two double beds and we requested a cot so we could be comfortable. The room had a bit of an odor inside especially um, we could notice it when we turn on the AC. We heard some other guests also complaining about the odors in their room too. The furniture on the balcony could use some upgrade. Um, we didn't have much of a view. Um, the room type is garden view but it seems more of a jungle view. But it was cool to be able to see um, some of the animals. This is the second day. Um, I just finished lunch this morning. We spent some time listening to the timeshare which we didn't buy so it's kind of waste. So now we're just on our way to the beach finally. Um, it's not too sunny today, it's a bit dull, but it's still nice, weather is good, it's not too hot, it's perfect. I wish I had taken some videos of the timeshare accommodations um, for those special guests. Um, they were very nice, the accommodations were a lot more modern, um, so much more nicer than the room we stayed in. The layout of the resort was nice. Everything is conveniently located. The building we stayed in was about 10 minute walk to the beach or a few minutes ride on the cart. By the beach is the larger pool area and then by our room there was a smaller pool area which was really good. As you can see, not many people in the water. The beach was not the best. This is the end of November, the ocean is colder, it's sandy, it's dirty. Some days were better than others. Um, we end up walking over to our neighbor resort. Um, their beach, for some reason, was a bit cleaner. But for the most part, we swam in the pool instead of the beach. The resort definitely needed to have more chairs at the beach and by the pool. It was very difficult to get seat in. And it, I'm on vacation. I'm not one of those people to get up early just able to save a chair. This day, after dinner, um, we went over to the square. They had a Mexican fair. Some of the vendors were selling jewelry, t-shirt, hats. So it's a good place to get some souvenir. Um, I end up just getting something small. I got myself a small cat figurine. It's good to support these local vendors um, as they're supposed to buy in, in the gift shop, um, which I did buy a few things in the gift shop. Um, but yeah, it's good to support um, these local vendors. 
Um, they can be pricey, but um, there's room to negotiate. Night shows were okay. We didn't actually go to see a show each night just because at this time of the year the mosquitoes were horrible. Um, but we prepared ourselves to make sure we went to see the fire show. By far, this one was the best. Very entertaining, and they had a beach party after. The layout of the resort is convenient. At the center square, you can find the buffet restaurant, jewelry store, gift shop, the gym. This is the main bar, the black and white bar. And here they have a snack bar inside, um, as well as a theater hall for the night shows. That's how the resorts were so cute, especially this one on top of the reindeer. I just had to take a video. It had about five a la carte restaurants and we tried the Mexican seafood and steakhouse. We were unable to get a reservation for other restaurants unfortunately. Um, so for the other meals for dinner we ate at the buffet and um, overall the food was okay. Some meals we really enjoyed and some could have been better. Um, but we had no problem finding things to eat. Um, the tacos were really good, we enjoyed that. And because of the time of the year, um, unfortunately we didn't get any of our favorite fruits um, to eat. This resort is one of the more affordable resorts in the area and overall it was good. Good service, staff was helpful, very friendly. It was a good trip. I wish the beaches were better, but at least they're better than the beaches in Canada, so it's always good to get away. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching.